Hey trombones, I'm going to walk you through some things in across the Serengeti today. First thing you want to look at is this different marking. It's called a marcado. It's this pointy top. It means you're going to play just a little louder and shorter than you usually would. And you see that particularly in measure 13 and measure 37. Next thing is there's lots of accented notes. So you want to make sure you approach those with a strong or toe so you get that hard T at the front next thing is these smooth connected parts okay you've got that slurred line you want to make sure that those notes are nice and smooth on trombone that means you're using a light D tongue T D D D D and last thing that's specific to you is in measures 6 through 9 and 11 through 13 and even at the end of the song, you're going to see two notes at once. You don't need to play two notes at once. I'm going to have you play the top note for each time that there's a split there. The euphoniums will play the bottom, and you are playing the top. Okay? So make sure when you see this kind of thing in your music, like I pointed out, measures 6 through 9, 11 through 13, and also the last three measures, play the top note. Okay? We're going to go ahead and play along with the recording now. It's called a multi-measure rest. There's a three over this one. Okay, so there's a lot in there. You don't need to video everything all at once. I've broken it down into separate parts of the music to work on. So you can do that just bit by bit, work through little things. One thing to take note of in this is you have some funky rhythmic stuff going on at measure 14. Let's clap through that. So here's measure 14. You're gonna play on two and three instead of like one and three or something like that. Here's 14 and 15, two, one, two, three, four, rest. Okay, so that's a little different. Do that with me. Two, one, two, three, four, rest. Try that again. This time I'll say the numbers that you're clapping. Two, one, two, three, four, rest, two, three, four, one, two, and three, four. So that's where you're playing. Now I'll play that. One, two, three, four. A little funky, right? Then you kind of have a similar setup in measure 18. Sorry, measure 16 and 17. Same rhythm, but different notes. Here's 16 and 17. Two, one, two, three, four. Okay. So pay attention to where your slide needs to go on those and also make sure you're playing them at the right time with the rhythm. Thanks for taking a look at this video and working on Across the Serengeti. Happy playing at home.